Welcome back everybody to Tony's Top Tips Workshop. Um, this is a quick video um, in response to a question or some problems that a viewer is having um, or one of my subscribers and it's regarding the MPG, the uh, movement controller as a lot call it. Um, this works independently of whether it's plugged into the computer via USB or you've got the offline control on. Powering the, the CNC machine up and attaching this, this should move the actual all the axes, fourth axis, X, Y and Z, should move them all. Um, and it, it, the, the chap that I've been talking to has a problem, he's had two of these controllers and neither of them work so he's, he were asking me for help and I said well all I can suggest is that what motherboard have you got is it the old is it the new mine's the original old motherboard and I didn't know whether the new ones actually were fault with it and it didn't support this I don't know I don't have the new motherboard for the Wi-Fi connection uh, or the Wi-Fi adapter um, I'm not bothering with that one but he said he got in touch with Sainsmart it was the I think he said it was the old motherboard um, I'll bear with me on that one um, I'll stand corrected but he received a new one from Sainsmart good service received a new one when he got the new one he installed it and lo and behold it still doesn't work now I, I did explain to him um, in messages that the, what he needs to do is not connect it to his PC nor the offline controller connected just this and if if it doesn't work when the CNC is powered up you should get a green light on it in the center it's telling it it's powered if it doesn't move then and he's put a new motherboard in so he's had two motherboards and two of these now a very unlikely it's going to be two motherboards or one and a new one in that case then it's going to be this for whatever reason i don't know but i'm just putting this video together just to show him what happens when you use this without anything connected other than this so i'll take you over to cnc and i'll show you right here we are at the cnc and um, as you can see USB not connected. Although it is in the motherboard, it's not connected. Okay. Offline controller not connected. Power is power on. So we've powered on. E stops are activated. Because you've got to be careful on that sometimes. Now this is the MPG okay so as you can see here we have a green light okay now this is just the how small amounts increments this works when you actually move this from one times ten times hundred okay it doesn't matter what it's on really when you turn that it should actually move the x and y it's not connected to anything it's just powered on is the CNC okay this is strictly for the gentleman that's having problems so we put it to X which I have done now and I put it to 10 as you can see there times 10 okay now my fourth axis works on where it says number four so okay now plus minus this plus minus always to home is minus away from it is plus okay so i will now turn that as you can see it works this works independently of anything other that's connected okay if i put it to y Okay, backwards and forwards. 
Z axis. There we are. It all works. Off. I always turn it to off because it's easy to knock that and it will move it. So be careful on that. But that's it. Why this um, for this gentleman um, it's not working I've no idea if he's got the green light in there in the center and it's connected up nothing else it should work there should be nothing interfering with it, uh, it this will work even if the offline controller is in you don't plug the offline controller in with the USB to the machine but I predominantly work from the, the offline controller um, it's I choose not to use the uh, uh, software on the machine well on the PC but there it is that's how best to test it before you connect anything up to make sure that this works um, I've not had any other feedback from anybody else as regards um, this um, hand wheel pendant hand wheel control controller not working uh, I have this uh, people having problems with this um, but very few maybe a couple that's all but this definitely I've had no further um, feedback that it's not working so I hope the gentleman's watching um, I'm going to send him a link to tell him that I've shown him how I test it how I tested it when it came anyway because um, I need without connecting to the PC uh, I need to move this about um, when I'm setting up so that's why I use this it's a great bit of kit um, especially alongside the offline controller so why his isn't working I've no idea um, if he's got two of these and both don't work and two different new motherboards and they don't work I don't know uh, unless there's something um, failing on the power supply that's the only other option I can think that ain't giving it the power to move I don't know um, I can't help him on that one I'm hoping he gets this he can test it out and he'll give me some feedback well that's showing you the uh, hand wheel working um, the other thing to, to check is make sure that um, and I'm sure the gentleman has um, uh, make sure none of your actual micro switches for your limit switches are activated um, because if one of those is activated this it, it will not work um, because the safety is coming so um, check all those make sure you've not got one that's faulty that's shorted out um, the way, simple way to check that is connect it up to your PC or offline control if you've got it and if it moves about then it's not your e-stops uh, or that so um, that cuts that problem out then well that's the conclusion of this short video you know as I re said earlier that this is just for the gentleman that's having problems um, and I hate it when people have problems with something and they're frustrated with it and I try and help them but this particular occasion um, by showing him this and telling him that um, maybe his motherboard's faulty but they sent him a new one um, I don't know I'm stumped with it myself um, I'm hoping he solves the problem and he can give me that feedback because um, I'd love to hear from it so right ending that video um, so like and subscribe in the comments let me know if you've had the same problem and, and how you've rectified it because it's the first time I've come across this um, and I can pass that on to my subscribers or my viewers uh, in fact I'd do a video on it um, so as I always say in the video please you be safe you be careful and bye for now